Okay, I moved into my house back in 2001, like early 2001, and apparently before, you know, my uh, I actually moved into my house, it was like renovated. You can see this window right here. It has, you know, only like, you know, a single pane to it. It's a very old window with an only a single pane. P-A-N-E. And um, most, uh, you know, new windows have a double pane to prevent the, you know, uh, you know, uh, uh, heat from escaping your house in the winter, or either that, or, um, you know, the cold, uh, or the, uh, heat coming in your house in the summertime. Of course, they ended up installing, uh, you know, a storm windows to my, you know, uh, vintage windows here. And I have to say, these storm windows are a piece of shit. They are a piece of shit, big time. I went to open, you know, up this window in my storm window because it's kind of muggy in my house. I'm going to use my big fan in my, you know, that I have in my utility room for, you know, uh, Helping suck air in, you know, uh, these windows here. And I tell you, these storm windows are a piece of shit. Look how easy this tears apart. The damn uh, rubber underneath this window metal won't even, like, you know, uh, stay intact either. Man, did the original owner of my house, like, you know, just buy windows from a very cheap company that sold them for only $5? This is sorry. This is very sorry here. Guess I'll have to take super glue or something to hold these windows together. This weekend, I'm going to put in my window air conditioners. Well, one of the air conditioners is going, going through that big window I'm pointing at. And um, anyway, I've had trouble with, you know, my other storm windows breaking apart one by one on me. These are sorry storm windows. And if I had the money to do it, I would probably rip all the storm windows off all these old windows and have, you know, uh, quality storm windows installed to my house. Because these current storm windows are sorry. Look at that. All that's keeping this mental frame down is friction. The only thing that's keeping these rubber things on is friction. What a sorry, glassy piece of shit, I tell you. I got this big metal fan here that I actually had before I was able to buy window air conditioners. Had it for about 10 years. Nowadays, I kind of use it as a whole house fan. And you're going to see why I want my windows open for this. Let's turn this puppy on. I shouldn't say puppy. I should probably say big dog. Okay, it's blowing air out this window here. Okay, as you can see, that fan is actually doing the trick. It's sucking the air in through my open bathroom window here and um the big fan sucking in air you know uh through all my windows that are open 
is the only alternative I have until I can install window air can my window air conditioners this weekend. My central air conditioner went out on me years ago. I haven't had enough money to replace it, so um, I use window air conditioners in the summer, and uh, whenever uh, turns winter, I take you know the window air conditioners out to increase the longevity of them, of having to you know be in all that winter wet weather, and also to prevent to provide you know better sealant to all my windows to keep the heat in during the winter. But until I can get the window air conditioners in, that big fan is the only alternative I have. Feel a nice breeze coming in the windows. But I have to say, see these storm windows here? Them storm windows are a sorry piece of shit. They should have never put them on the market. No, they should have never put them stupid storm windows on the market.